The streets of downtown Nashville, they are changing as we get ready for this summer's Music City Grand Prix Indie Race and Festival. News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs shows us some of the preparations for this big event. We are 60 days out from cars being on the racetrack here in Nashville. Come August, the tunes blaring down Music City will sound a lot different. Will be sounds of indie cars racing through Nashville's downtown streets. It's very exciting to be bringing racing to the Music City, not only because this is, you know, my hometown. I was born and raised here, but because this is just such a uh, a racing community. Jason Rittenberry is the chief operating officer for the Big Machine Music City Grand Prix. We've got uh, some asphalt that's torn up. We'll get new asphalt, but you also see the forms that these guys are building right here now. He says before the cars take on downtown, there's a race to turn these streets into a track. That means we're having to get Nissan Stadium parking lot as well as our city streets prepared to be a race course for these 200 mile an hour Indy cars. The track will take racers by Nissan Stadium over the Korean War Veterans Memorial Bridge into downtown. It's the first motorsports course of its kind in the world to cross a major body of water. This would normally be a parking lot for game days. Uh, we are turning this into our paddock and the pit lanes. Construction crews are ripping out the asphalt from the stadium's parking lot to lay down concrete. They're also doing work along the KBB Bridge. Rittenberry says a process that typically takes months will be done in just days. There's so many race fans here that have been waiting for this for a really long time. The three-day event is estimated to bring in anywhere between 30 to $35 million for Nashville. And all preparations to streets and parking lots for the race will cost the city nothing and will be repaired at no cost when the event is over. There was definitely a desire to bring this racing back and to do it on the city streets. Uh, that's what's going to be most exciting about it. For now, Music City Grand Prix has a three-year deal to continue to bring the event to Nashville. Fans hope the race will continue far longer than that. Well, our goal is for this to be forever, absolutely. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.